What's up guys, we're in Walmart today and today we are going to be doing a Christmas uh, wish list type of video. So um, I have three kids that I'm going to be shopping for. Really they're six, but I'm going to do like five gifts for each one of them just so you guys can see. Um, <laughs> how do I put this? I usually do this on excuse me, my other channel, but today I'm doing a Christmas wish list on this channel, okay? All right. All right, so first game I would get is this one because it reminds me of the virtual reality life game that we like to play. Hold on, let me zoom out for a second. Okay, so I like the game of life. My family and I, my kids, when we were together permanently, like every day of the week, we loved, absolutely loved to play board games, you know, at night with each other and stuff. We used to play the virtual reality um, life game on my son's tablet. So for my nine-year-old boys, I would get this game of life because I feel like that would be something they would enjoy Sweet. so I'm gonna get that so the next thing I would get and you guys are gonna find this kind of interesting the way that I do this but this is absolutely the way that I did it in 2020 and I got everything that I needed I would get this Roblox gun because my son loves Roblox okay so I would get this Roblox gun this Roblox XD I think it is it's a nerf gun and it's for the Sharp Bike web launcher game, I guess it is. So I would get this. It really, for us, it would just be shooting fire rockets or whatever. They can play Nerf together. So I would get this Nerf gun. Actually, 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 guys, I know that we love Roblox in this family, but I am a deal seeker. <laughs> so let me put that one back. The one that I, I know he loves Roblox, but I would get this one. And it's a terror shot, okay? Because I like um, this brand, the Walmart brand. And these are $26. 88 cent versus the 33 88 okay so we save a little bit of money and we get two of these guns i would get this here adventure boys terror shotgun i would get this one and then i would also pick up one for his sibling as well so that they could both play okay so that's the combination gift all right so they're both yellow i would just find a different way to mark them so i would get those okay two of those all right, so here's another Adventure Force uh, gun. This one is called the Villainator. This one is actually better than the Terror Shot. So we have the Terror Shot and the Villainator. They're both um, the same type of gun, and we have multiple. We have like over 130 bullets for us to shoot with. So that's good. So as you see, I changed it because I wanted the color to be different. So that's yellow. That's green. That's how I differentiate the colors. Okay. These are under $25, so they're a good deal. All right, so the next thing I would get would be one of my all-time favorite things, remote control cars, which I'm absolutely, absolutely in love with. Now, this is on a, this is on a good, good year, a good payday week. We have this um, blue Ford. It's normally $23.88, and then it's, it's now $17. I would try that one because it's on clear. So let's see if we can find out. Oh, I think this is it. The Jacobs Ford 16 RC Blue. This is an RC and it's a blue Ford. So yeah, I would get this one, okay? These are $17 now. I would get two of these. I don't like getting the same colors, but I see that they're all um, the Fast and the Furious. Look, one sixteen RC blue Ford. And there's two of them, and they're, also, they're all in the same color. See, I don't wanna wind up getting all the same things, so I'm gonna have to put that back. <laughs> cause I was gonna say, because of $17, I would get this, cause I remember I got my orange one, it was like $50 almost, and he liked it. But anyway, put those back. We have to find a really good truck. These monster trucks are $25. Those are good. But to be honest, I really like these. And they are $89 for the RC Polaris. I cannot get that one. Because <laughs> I'm thinking now for two boys. Now remember. <clears throat> I guess I didn't explain it right to you guys. So I'm going to say it again. The life game is for them to play together. The guns are for them to play together. Um, We got this last year. I love these dinosaurs. I love these, and they're on sale for $19. So I think these would actually be a good gift. But again, I don't want to get them the same thing, but you could get two for $36. So <laughs> let's focus one thing at a time. Let's find their trucks, okay? So that's what I, I want a remote control truck so bad, so I got to work to get one. They have this Spider Man truck. I like that. They have this one here is on sale for $45. That's not much of a sale, so I don't want to try that one. Hmm. Okay, how about these? <clears throat> Let's try the F-150 by New Bright because they're different. I don't want this though. 
But for right now, the best deal I can get is the red F-150 by New Bright and then the blue RC Polaris by New Bright, okay? So that's like an example of what I want to do. These are the best cars that I could buy, so I actually would get these, all right? Now, another thing that I could do is buy a combination gift, which is this one up here. I could buy a combination gift, which is this heat <clears throat> USB turbo hypercharged vehicle um, toy. And it comes with two little remotes, as you can see, and then two little cars. And that's kind of cheap. But yeah, that's what I could do. And they will each get a car, a police car, and then like a charger or whatever. So I'm not really trying to save this deal. <laughs> so I put that in anyway. Okay, so they got one to share and two apart and then they got the guns and they got the um life board game so let's move along i love this thing right here but they got this last year and it's still in the box they haven't used it yet so we'll move on from that because <clears throat> they don't take all their toys out at once so this is good for me right now they got two shared gifts and then two separate gifts each all right so next thing we have to find them something to ride on so last year they got scooters and they were really happy with that as you guys saw they got these uh car scooters not this color but they got neon green and um blue and black the thing that i want them to ride on ideally would be a bicycle but i'm so in love with these little cub um hoverboards now these are for the girls or whatever so i would probably get my daughter this because she's just turning seven this year but for my son I would like to get him one and they have one about the same price which is this plasma x lava tech hoverboard so i would get him one of those and i would get his sibling one of those and they would just get different colors okay you can't take it out of the thing but that's what i would get all right so right now we're up to what three hundred dollars i think <clears throat> two hoverboards and two race cars that's the next thing if like if i want to push it two hoverboards two cars two trucks and then a board life game. That's what I would get. A life board game. That's what I would get. And the kids will be done. That's five gifts each. Okay, so now it's time for the girls. And like I said, I'm in love with this little cub hoverboard. So that's what I would get my daughter. And it's at 148. I love that. It's my go tracks or whatever. It's really, really cute. And I'm assuming that it will go, you know, fast enough for her. It says the max speed is 6.2 miles per hour. So I think she would love that. And that's what it looks like. All right, so next thing I would get <clears throat> for the ultimate girly girl to make her feel just perfect would be a shimmery metallic foot spa by Be Inspire. And these are really, really cute. And of course, those little kids always look like they're having so much fun. So I would get this one. This one is $30. So she's up to what? One, 180 now. All right, so she's up to 180 Oh, let me see. All right, so there. That's a good box right there. Okay, so she's up to 180. And remember, this is a thousand dollar shopping spree. If I didn't tell you guys that, for the whole group of kids, the whole group. Okay, next thing I'm totally in love with, and I just look at this doll every time I come in here, is this LOL um, OMG Fierce doll. All right, so she's thirty dollars. This one is um, this one is Fierce. No, her name is Royal B. She is so cute. She is thirty dollars. Like she is $27.44. She is very expensive, but she is so pretty. I guess this is like a little Kim, whatever it says, Royal B. Either way, this one is so cute. I would get this one. I'm in love with that one. Okay, so now we're at 220. The next thing I want to get is this LOL Fashion Clubhouse, which is on sale right here for $39. I think that's what it is. It says Fashion Show Runway. So let me make sure well i think this is what it is right no because it doesn't say 80 surprises the clubhouse is 39 dollars. wait is this it right here though lol omg house no that's 214 dollars Eh, cut that one i got one of that one because i can't figure out which one it is oh here we go the super mega runway is 138 dollars so we don't want to get that one we have to stick to the budget all right, guys, so instead of getting the LOL OMG Clubhouse, I decided to go with the LOL Surprise Fashion Show House, which is, well, it's, oh, see, Fashion Show House my, Mansion. It says $64 for this, so I guess it's like the movie studio where they're shooting things at. It does not say that, <laughs> but I'm going to get it for that price. Trust me, because it shouldn't have been there. That's where I got it from. So this one is $64. We were at $180. Now we're at $244. 
for Katie. And look what she has. Hoverboard, fashion house, foot spa, and a baby doll. $244. And she has only four gifts. So she has one more gift left. And pretty much she's not going to top $300, which is great. So let's see what else what we can find that we can find for her. Because it's like kind of like $350 each team <clears throat> is what I'm doing. So she has a little bit more left to go. The other thing that I've seen that I really, really liked, and I'm trying to do like an LOL thing for her because her aunt did an LOL birthday party for her, and I want everything to be cute. It's one of these little kits right here. I think it was this one, the Fashion Jewelry Studio, but I don't, and it's $15, but I don't think that she, being seven years old, can do that, you know, make bracelets and stuff like that. So I don't think I want to get that for her. So the other thing I thought about was this, which is $30. Well, she'll put her like 274 She really could get as much shorts as she wants to if she stays on everything. She has $300 at least. But that's that. So let's see if we can find something else. Let's see. I like that though. Hmm. And she's at $244. So a little girl might like a singing machine. That's cute, but I would want it to be a lot cuter than this. Okay, so this so glittery hand spa, glitter nail spa is seven dollars, so I would get that. Now all of these are those orb things. So I'm thinking you just stick your hands in it, it comes like little fingernail polishes. But for seven dollars you can't beat that. So foot spa nail spa, I get that too. She gets that and that and she gets the hoverboard. So then we want to go to she has two LOL things, that's good enough. Okay, I found it. It's $64, so they're about the same price. This is the movie studio place that it has 12 exclusive dolls inside of it. I like the little doll house, fashion show house, $64. And then she has a doll and she has foot spa and nail spa and a hoverboard. That's what I came up with. And it turns out that she saved like $10 because this, this right here is $54.97. So let's just go back and take a look at the pricing and see what we came up with. So. Mind you, that's $54.97. This one is $64. The nail spa was $7. The Royal Bee doll was actually $36.88. And the foot spa was $29.97. Alright, and the last thing to remember was the hoverboard was $148. The boys' hoverboard was 148 as well. The plasma iris hoverboard was 148, and <clears throat> the Polaris truck was 2497. All right, the RC Red truck was 3488. All right, so I can't find the price for the hypercharger, so I'm just gonna take it and check the price for those. All right, so there is a customer service representative, and I'm gonna see if I can get her to check the price of this truck for me, but she's not too busy. <laughs> hey, do you think I could get you to check the price of this for me? You have a scanner? I'll be on my video. I'm doing a video. It's okay. All right. It's <laughs> cute. Uh, let's see. The scanner. I think it's on yeah, right here. $39.97. All right. Thank you. Okay. So that one's $39.97. So we got those. And then the guns were... 25 each or they were just under 25 <clears throat> so let's see i'm gonna run over here real quick and check it was the villainator the villainator is 22 and then the other gun was the terror shot which was 2688 that's that all right and then just so we remember the life game was on sale for $15.97. Wait, well, here's a picture of our cart, guys. And this is just with the girl stuff and one of the boys' toys. All right, guys, so next up, we are shopping for my 20-year-old. <laughs> my 20-year-old, guys, I have a 20-year-old. So the first thing you want to do is find, like, um, 
I don't know, things that would be useful for him in his life. And the first thing I came up with was uh, TV equipment. So I see that they have hanging bars. So I decided to try to get a hanging bar and speaker set for his front room so he can hang his TV on the wall or in his bedroom even. So the hanging bar is 24. I want to try to get that. Hold up, hold up, hold up. The hanging bar is 20.97. Now the speaker bar is 179. Don't want that one. There is another one down here that's like $59, and I think that's such a really good price. Let me show you guys that one, cause it looks about the same. So <clears throat> I would get that. Go ahead, and then I would get this right here. Oh my God, it's 2.29. It said 29 the other day. Let me see. Well, the cheaper of the two. This one's 2.29, so we know we don't want that one. Where is the other one? It was like $50. They may have sold out. So I came in here pricing them the other day. This one is $2.29. We will find it. Hold on just a second. All right. So that one we looked at was $2.29. And then the other one was $1.76. And I found these other two by Vizio that might be a little bit cheaper. So I'm going to price one of these and see which one is the cheaper. Cheapest. So that's the sound bar and speaker set. And this is the sound bar and speaker set. So I would get one of these two. Give me just a moment. Yeah, let's see how much that one costs. Hey, how you doing? Oh, <laughs> all right. I don't have that app. 219. 219. Yep. Okay. That was on my Alto that was here yesterday. It was like $59 or something. A Vizio? No, it was about Alto. A-L-C-O-L-A-L-C or something like that. Alto. Uh, Alto. Alto. Oh, okay. Well, they got a lot of them. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. All right. So, it looks like that one is not going to be the one we get. The one we would get, it would be the blue one. It would be the on one. But definitely we're going for that because he has $350. So why not? All right. So we get the, and it probably works better for them to all have the same brand. So we get these, this one, the on one, that's $179. And then we get the hanging bar, which is $297. So it makes it $189, $190, $190 for those two things for him. So he gets those two. He already has a television, I'm assuming. So we're going to move on from that type of equipment to something else. All right, and so I came back here to find the on television set just so I could tell you guys in case you were wondering how much an on TV would be. So this is in the box. It's a Roku TV, and it would be $198. So he would be at $400 if he were to get this television and that other stuff. So he has to stay below $400. So this is the TV that would go with that, and it's actually $200. All right, so let's move on. All right, so my son's a gamer. So, you know, I'm looking for all things comfortable when I'm thinking about him. So the next thing I want to see, want to try and find is like the newest type of gaming chair that he might not have already. Because, you know, <laughs> that would be the next best thing. All right, what I mean by that is that you hang the TV on the wall, you know, you get the, the loudspeaker system. He already has the television, he already has the video game. You just want to hype things up and make it look greater. So I want to take a look at some of these chairs we have here by um, X Parker. They're gaming seats and they're on sale for $45. Now, I don't know if he would do this in a living room or the bedroom or whatever, but that's what they have. So the gaming chair for $45 is the next step for me. I will grab one of these right here. Okay, so that's $45. That puts us at what? $235. So we're at $235 and we have $70 to go. So we have the chair. We have the stuff for the television. What can we get for $70 that he might need? <laughs> Alright, so me being the mom that I am and knowing the ropes of this whole thing, for the gamer <laughs> and the ultimate video game experience, what would be better than an Xbox Live Gold subscription for a full 12 months at $59.99? an xbox he does not have an xbox i have to remember he has a switch so we have to try and see if there's something like that for him here and i've been through this with my kids so many times like i know i know this whole routine so i'm kind of scared to do this and i kind of want to be away from it because he he doesn't want the same thing every y'all it's like so let's see for switch you have what sparks of hope they have like full game downloads for that price 60 dollars for this uh mario game um $60 for this Pokemon Pokemon. He's 20 years old. So I don't even know what he likes to play So I'm gonna think that's a no on that one. And let's move on to something else All right, so let's pull a full 360 We're in the art department now. Okay, so we decided to scratch the whole idea of doing a video game and pick out another one of my kids interests Which is art now. He is kind of like a graphic designer anime animator type kid <coughs> So I was thinking he might be 
interested in some tools to draw with. So maybe a sketchbook. I don't know. These are nine nine thirty seven for this sketchbook by design or whatever kind of design or whatever. This is a weird name. It's French or something. But either way, it's a nice black sketchbook and has lots of paper in it. And I think that this one will be pretty good to practice it. I don't know. Nine thirty seven is a good deal. We have seventy dollars to play with. If he likes to paint, I would try and get him paint or whatever. But he doesn't. So let's see what else he might like. There is this easel here, and I like it. It's twenty three fifty two. That's not bad, but that that again is for a painter. It's not for an artist. So let's see what else we can find. Hmm. Right now, I'm looking at this uh, sketch pencil set. It has eraser, um, oil pastels, a really good pencil, and then a charcoal medium. So I'm going to try this. Right now, I'm leaning towards these two things, and we are at $15, okay? So we have these two items right here. So... Out of 15, we're at what? We have $55 to go. So let's see. What else will we get? We have a sketchbook and some sketch pencils. They have a kit down here. <clears throat> this has a lot of pencils in it. It says sketching beginners arts yet, but it's expensive. It's $15.76. So I don't know if that's good or not. It comes with a really nice kit. It has carving utensils, pencils, um, pastels. All kinds of stuff. I mean, it's really nice. And I guess it has a mannequin that you can like. What is that mannequin for? That's really neat. That's for an animator. I think that would be really cool. But I don't know if I'm going to get that or not. So, I'm going to move on down here and see what else we can find. Alright, so I didn't find much. So, let's compare. We get the book and the pencil at $50. Or for one price of $15, maybe $16, we get this sketching kit. I don't want this kit because it has a lot of things in it that I don't really know about. I don't know what they're for, but that's for a really good animator, and yeah. So I stick with this. It's $15. We spend that <clears throat> one time and get it done with, okay? And then we move on. I am a mom. I'm not a teacher. So I don't know what these kids might need, you know, for their future as artists or whatever, but I figured this is a good start. All right, so the next thing that I found for this art um, expedition that we're on here. It's gonna be this Prismacolor Technique online lessons for drawing. And this is level one drawing shading, which we've seen his Instagram, so we know he's pat we know he's past that. But we think it's kind of fun to like explore different things. So instead of doing plant life, I think I would go with the animal drawing set. And it's 2247. So now we're at 33, 30, what? 23 and 15. 38 38 and 39 dollars okay so we're there so we have 30 dollars left which is not so bad because we're getting a lot of gifts but well we're at what five we're at five gifts right now but they're all like about the same thing so i could put all of these in a box so now we have um 25 dollars left to go with let's see what else we can come up with all right guys all right so i found a way to end my shopping spree this sort of um <clears throat> sort of pedic has these comforter sets, the So Soft uh, two-piece bedding set. I think that's really cute and kind of mature looking. So I was thinking about going with this. So it comes with one twin comforter and one standard pillow sham. And it is sort of comforter set, $18. I was thinking about getting that. Cause again, that's the switching gears. I don't know like directly how to shop for an adult. He's been a kid so long for me. So the next thing I was thinking about getting is a bunch of towels for him. <clears throat> this is by Oswell. It is six dollars and it is what two hand towels and two washcloths and then at the end grab him a bunch of towels which kind of which kind of puts him like over the mark a little bit but exactly where I want him to be so I get those for six and get him a large towel. Where is it at? <laughs> I'm looking for it. These are all washcloths and hand towels and stuff. So anyway I get this because it kind of matches and then get a hand towel is what I'm thinking. All right, so here's a bath towel for eight bucks, and it puts it over a little bit, but I don't think we're right on the marker with everything. So tell me, guys, what do you think? The TV stuff, the comforter bath towel set, which is kind of like a mom gift, giving them that type of stuff. And then we got like $25, $30, $35 actually worth of art material. What do you think about what we did today? Comment down below any ideas that you think we could have used in today's video to make our gift giving experience a little bit better. And again, guys, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I want to thank you guys for so much. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you guys again next week. Bye.